Alright, hello everyone, and welcome back, finally, to Riven. It's been, as of as of the time I'm recording this, it's been about 10 days since I've made a new video, so I figured I might as well do another one. Uh, this week is currently finals week for me. Luckily, uh, I'm not too worried about them, so I, think I'm, so I think I'm okay on that front. But yeah, mainly it's just been a combination of... Me trying to get my paper done for my final on my English final on Tuesday, as well as my presentation. As and and also that combined with just flat out laziness uh was really the cause for delay of this video. But I'm back, I'm here now. And we're ready to get back into it. So when we left off, we discovered a secret cavern inside of this what I th what I assumed was a holding cell, but it seems it's a bit more than that. So we're going to resume. This is where we left off. <clears throat> now, there's two things that I'm particularly interested in. There's two s s slabs here. First being this one, of course. This is the wark, and the second one being that. This one, because this this is what appears to be the fish that we encounter on the beach. <clears throat> I'm not sure what exactly they're called. Uh, if someone can actually tell me what, what they're what they're really called, that would be uh, that would actually be great. As long as they're not related to anything spoilerish. Uh, excuse me. <coughs> So yeah, what I what I want to do is I want to tr first of all I want to try the obvious. I want to push one of these slabs down, and for each respective animal that I push, for each respective animal slabs that I push down, I want to go to where they are. And interact with them and see if anything changes. So that's going to be the most obvious thing. But first, actually, I kind of want to save just to make sure that it actually saves the progress of me having pushed down that the stone. Attached to this shit, is there? Okay, good. Wait. Okay, good. Just making sure. <laughs> Actually, you know what? The uh, the other stone might actually be a better idea because it's closer. Also, you have a you have a pretty decent upper body strength. To uh, be able to climb yourself up that ladder. So I think I'll do the. Uh, I think I'll do the uh, the beach dinosaur first because it's because it's closer, it's more nearby, and it just makes the most sense. That's not what I wanted to do, but okay. <clears throat> uh, that's also not what I wanted to do. Bring it back up. So if I get out of here, will it actually 
keep the memory of which stone I ended up actually pushing down, I wonder. <clears throat> I apologize. So now what we're going to do is we're going to turn back. We're going to see if it actually... If it's still actually put... It is. Okay, that's good. That's very good. go and we will interact with the dinosaurs and hopefully something is different and I still cannot see what the hell this thing is brilliant also why is it is that just a little viewing sort of a little sort of viewing window Sorry, I don't speak your language. Really sorry about that. Can you speak English? No? Okay. What if what if I do this then? <clears throat> oh wait, what if I Now, what if I go back? They're not... Uh... The people in the towers aren't tripping the, uh... Tripping the alarm when I come across them now. Which I suppose is a good thing. So let's see if this has changed... Really anything. I'm actually really curious. I'm just gonna make sure that this recording is going okay. Which it is. Alright, good. That's what we want. After all, if the recording went to shit, then you really can't do- Okay, so this is- this is pushed back up now. <clears throat> Why is that? Hmm. Okay, well... Alright, let's try pushing this down then. Uh, can I actually... No, I can't. Okay. Oh, I can. All right, that's great to know. Yeah, there's uh, nothing else up here. All right. I just want to make sure that the, that the slab is still up after I've 
ended up going outside. Okay, I, can't, I guess I can't skip this. Which makes sense. Oh no, it doesn't. Oh wow, okay. Well, that's just great. Alright, well, in that case, what I might have to do is I might have to provoke the, uh, the wark over on Gen's fortress. And then once that's done, then, uh, I, let's just see past this. And then once I get it to, uh, basically fuck off, I can just come back here and then push the, uh, stone down and see what happens. Oh wait, no, 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 it's over here, over here. Open this thing up. <laughs> excuse me. Also, excuse me for this. <coughs> okay, now that little that little episode's over. Let's go down. Uh, let's turn back. Right, I completely forgot to mention. Uh, <laughs> so, I'm still not allowing hints quite yet. I'm only going to do that when I'm really, really stuck and I cannot, and I absolutely cannot figure out how to get ahead. So, I'm going to be saving those. So, they're still not okay. So, just wait until I give the all clear. So there's there's a, the update on those, which is there is no update. It's still the same. It's still the same issue. All right, let's uh, let's poke the bull here. It's just a always a wonderful idea. Let's take this dangerous animal and agitate it. Alright. Come on. Hey. Alright, see ya. Let's 
Let's, uh, let's poke it. I think it needs a bit more encouragement. Okay. Here we go. This should be the one to do it. Come on, come on. Ram the glass. Come on! Yeah! Come on, do it again. Do it again, I dare you. Come on. Oh, come on. Alright, now, if I'm correct, you should no longer come back. Yep. Alright, now, what I'm gonna do. Lift that up, get out of the throne, go back, and see what, if anything, has changed. mouth let it regurgitate me that sounds wrong but whatever we'll just ignore that you're going to go back fuck you we're gonna go back <laughs> are still very much wary of me. <clears throat> I thought someone said that there was a, a button to skip cutscenes, but they couldn't remember what it was. I think it might be... I, I tried looking for it online. I didn't come run across any spoilers, for the record. I didn't... But I tried looking for that button online, I couldn't find it. So it might only be in the in the original manual that came with the game when it was first sold. That's what I'm thinking. Or maybe I shouldn't look hard enough, who knows. So let's go back in here. Let's see... If anything at all has changed. I'm hoping that something has. Otherwise, this would have been a very colossal waste of time. <clears throat> Alright, so nothing has changed. Well, let's try pushing this down and see where that gets us. Absolutely fucking nowhere. Okay. Um. All right. Well. How about we? Excuse me. How about we go over here? See if anything's changed here. No. 
Okay, so this is where it starts to get. Yep, this is a. Uh, this is where I back myself into a corner, basically. <laughs> Let's, let's push both these down, why not? I should probably have my notes over here. That would definitely help. God, it's late. I'm sorry. Nothing's changed, but at the very least, we now know something that doesn't work. So you can't just go over to the animals, interact with them, and then come back here and then push down the slabs. It's not that simple, and, and now we know that, which is good. We... We can't. God damn it. It's, it's really late. And I haven't gotten a lot of sleep last night, so. Yeah. There you go. Also, someone did say that. I believe I parked the submarine right here on the dock, and someone said that uh, the submarine actually resets its location back over to here, and we'll see. And yep, you're right. It is, in fact. Most likely back over there. <clears throat> back where it first was. So thank you for letting me know that ahead of time. <sighs> oh god, it's... Even for... It's all the way back up here? Oh, okay. Oh, I can actually get in it from here. Huh. That's cool. Oh, well, I can't... do anything with it, then. Alright, now get in, get in, get in, get in, get in! Come on, you could've made that! Okay, fine. What's this chunk of meat here? So I thought that maybe, maybe you have to get the wark killed somehow and then placed on top of here as a sacrifice or something. Maybe, because I figured that that's what might have been this giant slab of meat is this okay don't make the baby start crying I got enough shit to deal with as it is which I feel like is the thought process of every parent every every new parent just god make the baby stop fucking crying also if you can understand anything I'm saying I'm very impressed because <laughs> my speech is already bad enough and coupled with the coupled with the fact that that uh I tend to over oh okay I didn't mean to do that but hey Coupled with the fact that I tend to speak way too fast, it can make me pretty hard to understand sometimes. Uh, oh yeah, this is how I get to the, the submarine.
What is with this? That's gotta be just a red herring. Cause I can't see how that would be of any use. To... To this. Like, okay, I'm pretty sure that it leads to the water pump island. I want to say it does. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm about 90% sure because I can't think of anywhere else it can go. Oh yeah, the, uh, the, uh, the schoolhouse. Or what appears to be as close to a schoolhouse as you can get in this, on this island. Oh, you know what? I never actually looked back at that unused linking book in the furnace back in Gen's sort of workshop slash laboratory. I never actually uh, took the time to, to go back and check on that in a while, so I might do that after this. here we can go This sounds unbearable. I just. It's something that can't really be helped. <laughs> God, just. Do you want to go in there? Just look at that. Look at that. That looks like it leads off straight into nothingness. Who wants to go in there? <laughs> And you go in there, you realize, oh wow, it's actually very well lit. I don't know if that has anything to do with anything in this story. Like I said before, I'm pretty sure he's speaking backwards there, though. Like, there's there's something in red pen right there. But it's, it's not letting me look. More importantly, what is the... Oh... Whoa. Wait a minute now. What? What is happening? 
happening? What is <laughs> All right. I can I hope this I hope this can be reset cuz I I was not paying attention. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna have to... Oh, Jesus. I'm so <laughs> fucking hell. Oh no, am I supposed to keep in track of the accounts when the when the actual symbols show up? Because I haven't been doing that. Oh shit. <clears throat> okay, well that doesn't have anything to do with anything. That was nine. Let me just write this down. Equals what appears to be nine. That's one. These one have a designated number. Oh, here we go. Okay, so that equals nine no matter what. Okay, well we're not gonna know about that. Or, nope. That's gonna just remain in the dark. That's four. All right. I knew this. I knew this machine looked suspicious, and I was right. <clears throat> Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. Jesus, okay. So 
So let me draw that better. There we go, much better. All right, so 10 was that. Okay, it's got to give me something else soon enough. Or not. So that was seven, if I counted correctly. So Vega goes from one to ten. It was seven? Okay. Back to this guy. Please don't let it be one that I need. Okay, good. Right, we uh Alright. I think all we need is three more numbers and we should be okay. If this is a thing from one to ten. Six. Six. Okay, good. That's a number we haven't gotten yet? Again, the number we haven't gotten before, so that's eight. That is an absurdly long, absurdly long symbol, but we'll go with it. So eight. Actually, is that all of them? Nine. No, wh which number are we missing? Five. We're missing five. I need to find out what five is. That's all.
gonna be nine. This is gonna be nine. God damn it. All right. I'm pretty sure it's just the horizontal line, right? My God, is it really? I know it's a one in ten chance, but it's it's is it really that hard to get? Apparently it is. Five, six. Yep. This one's seven. I just need to be absolutely sure that this is gonna be that this is that with the symbol that I'm thinking of is five. I just need to make sure. <sighs> Unfortunately the game cannot understand that. Ten. Oh, come on, man. happening here. Okay, we stuck for hours with this fucking thing. Holy shit. What is with this thing? Oh my god. I just need the one. And then I can go. At least it's giving me ones. It's giving me low numbers so far. And now it's giving me a fucking nine. Okay. Are you fucking serious? You fucking kidding me? The one time it lands on the one that I need, it just resets itself? Really? That's how this shit's gonna work? Alright, well, there, here's the thing. At least we can tell by process of elimination. It's not even that big of a deal. We can tell by process of elimination that this is, in fact, five. Okay, so it's not that big of a deal. It's just that's my fucking luck at work. It's my luck in motion. Alright, there we go. We're done. We can leave. I'm just waiting for the one time I'm gonna open this door and then someone's just gonna be fucking standing there. Just waiting for me. And it's gonna be horrifying. The oh, right, I gotta turn around. <laughs> so what I'm guessing is that is that this uh, this sorry this uh, this thing is giving me basically the sort of the method to decode the uh the coded message that we saw in Gen's journal <clears throat> and we're 
are going to turn around. No, that's not what we're going to do. That's what we need to turn around. So I'm obviously thinking that the yeah sorry <coughs> I'm obviously thinking that the uh, the button the button puzzle on the telescope looking thing on the on that you start out on if you understand a single word that I mentioned there and the coded message against journal are related because they're both a series of five things. So what I want to do is I kind of want to go back to the I want to go back to starting island and I want to see if I can solve the puzzle. So here we go. I just want to try it out, and that way, if it doesn't, and this way, if it doesn't work, then we know it doesn't work, and we don't have to keep going back to it in the future. So here's. Okay, so the first one is K I, which is three. So we'll press this. We'll try this. The next one is uh, the horizontal line going across, which is five. The next one, hmm, it's honestly debatable. The closest thing I have to the third symbol in the in the code is number two so we'll, let's just press that for now <clears throat> excuse me next is uh, okay um, I'm actually not hundred percent sure which one this is yeah this probably isn't the solution but hey it's F, it's worth a shot so we'll go with one and then four Okay, that obviously didn't work, so... Alright. I think... That's... Yeah... 
I think that's just about all I can do on that front. Um. Yeah, there's really nothing. Well, hold on. We'll try this. So, one, two, three. And then we'll try one, two, three, four, five. Now, what would I do for this? Well, I suppose I can try this. I can go... Ooh, wait a minute. Wait, what? Oh, how did I not notice that before? Oh, it's so obvious. So the symbols from... I don't know if you understand what exactly I mean, but... The symbols from... 6 through... I believe... Ten, no, not 10 the symbols through from six to nine are certain are the symbols from one to five that are combined to make those numbers so nine is just a combination of four and five that's it that's all it is and similar to that seven is a combination of two and five 8 is a combination of 3 and 5. Wow, that's interesting. I don't know how I didn't see that before. Huh. And of course, 6 is a combination of 5 and 1. So it's all... They're all combinations of 5 and some other number. And, and another number that's below 5. But above but at least one or more. That's okay. That makes sense, actually. Right, anyways, back to this. <laughs> so this looks like it would be 11. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I don't know what this next one would be. I really don't know. What the hell even is that? What? Shit. Okay, I'm thinking that has to be either just an invalid symbol or it's just something that I haven't just it's probably something that I haven't discovered yet. The sword in the forest, I'm also kind of unsure about because I have nothing that says what that number could be. right on the sides so it's this all right how long has we been recording for? 55 minutes. Not too bad. Although I might just, I'm probably going to have to stop soon. 
as a matter of fact, this could actually be a stopping point, or this could actually be a good stopping point. Although, let's do one more thing. Let's go after... What I kind of want to do is I want to go and check on that... That's an unused linking book that was in the furnace and see if anything has changed or not. Really want to go check up on it. Just, just to make sure that nothing has changed. And then I'll probably end this episode here. So has anything changed at all? The answer is, is a resounding no. Alright. Well. I don't know, should I... Here, I probably should. I think it would be wise to end it here because I need to get some sleep. Alright, well, there's this, there is that part of Riven done. We, uh, we did make some new discoveries. We, we figured out how that, uh, how the hanging body contraption in the classroom worked. Just a pretty morbid, morbid toy for for some kids. I'll say that much. Um, but then again, so is pretty much every video game nowadays, isn't it? Uh, whatever. Just, just follow the ESRB ratings strictly. That's all you gotta do. You'll be a great parent if you do that. Trust me. And of course, if you pay for bills and tuition and stuff like that. But anyway, sis. <laughs> all right. It's about time that I ended this uh, this episode. Uh, hints are still not okay, just for the record. Still don't quite want to do that just yet, but uh, maybe in the next episode I might make it okay. Although I, I probably will only call on one person that I know will comment on the video to do it. So maybe I'll just, maybe I'll just do that, but for now... Uh, no more hints. No hints. Uh, <laughs> yeah, and I think that'll do it for today. So I hope you enjoyed the video. And I will see you in the next part. Goodbye.